Sometimes your pictures just can't get right. You might need to remove something from an image or you may even want to spice things up by replacing something with something else. PowerDirector has an AI replace tool that meets both of those needs. So today I'm going to show you how to transform your photos by removing or replacing objects in PowerDirector 365. Let's brush up some images. First, let's go ahead and replace an object. We're going to go up to Gen AI. We'll left click on that. And then we're going to go down to AI replace and left click that. A message pops up telling you what this is. You can click on okay. And here you'll see some recommended advice for best results, as well as some things to avoid when selecting your image. You want to left click on import image and from this device or from an AI generated image. And I'm going to select from this device. Now you can go to the location on your machine where the image is. And when you get there, you can left click on the image you want to use and left click on open. Next, you can left click on continue. Now we'll start off by using the brush tool. You can adjust the size of the brush if you need. I'm going to leave it at 50. And then you want to brush over by holding down your left mouse button and dragging it over the object that you want to replace. Now you don't have to be perfect here. Does a really good job of understanding what it is that you're trying to replace. Then you need to describe what you want to replace the object with. So I'm going to replace it with a plain red ball sitting on the floor. And then I'm going to left click on generate. And it was replaced. Now, if you want to see what it looked like before, you can place your cursor over the original photo icon, hold down your left mouse button, and it'll show what it looked like before you replaced it. And if you let go of your mouth, you'll see what it looks like afterwards. If you want to see multiple things that you created, you can always click on my creations and it'll pull up all of the items that you created You can close this out. And now you can left click on download to library and it'll put it into the media library. You get a message here telling you that it's done. You can left click on okay. And you can close this out and you can use your created image in your videos. Now it's time to erase an object. But before I rub one out, I need you to click the like button, subscribe to power director university and click the bell. So you don't miss out on any of my tutorials and live streams. So let's go ahead and remove an object. We're going to go back up to gen AI, left click on that. We're going to left click on AI replace. We'll left click on okay. We'll left click on import image. We're going to left click on from this device. We'll go to the same location. This time I want to select this image here and I'll left click on open. And now I'll left click on continue. This time I'm going to use the brush tool to brush out our canine friend here. And now in the description, I'm just going to say remove masked object. And I'm going to left click on generate. And now you can see that the object was removed. Bye bye doggy. Sorry. And you can see before and after by going to the original photo icon, left ho holding down your left mouse button and then releasing it when you want to see what happened after. Once again, when you're done, you can go ahead and download to library. Left click on OK. And you can close it out. Now, if you want to see three video editing hacks that'll save you time, check out this tutorial. Don't forget to subscribe and purchase PowerDirector using the links in the video description to help the channel stay alive.